This is Coach Karan Godwin, and these are the Ball Hog Gloves training products. We have everything you need from ball handling gloves, bump pads, shooting eggs, and cones. Go to ballhoggloves.com. God first, work until. Let's see, this is what you're going to be dealing with the entire night. Middle pick and roll with CP3 and DeAndre Ayton. And you're going to have to step up and get higher if you're Daniel Gafford. I know it's a tough task. Paul picks up his dribble. Let's see if Gafford can stay solid on the defense on Ayton. That's a nice move right there. That ends with that hook shot there by DeAndre Ayton. Away from the pain, he's bringing the pain right into the chest of the defender. It's Aiden's turnaround jumper here against the Phoenix Suns. DeAndre Aiden ranges out, hit that mid range jumper. Landale thought about a three. Aiden picks up his dribble just inside the free throw line extension. So every time he gets to that free throw line extended jumper, you just think it's going down. There's Aiden over Obdia. I mean, Torrey Craig almost stepped on the half court line as Washington Jr. to Aiden. Oh, not too much space. Way too much space. Yeah. So no Bradley Beal tonight, and the, the big two have come up big. DeAndre Aiden scores again. <laughs> Bridges to Aiden. DeAndre Aiden again. A contest by Kyle Kuzma, but you got a rebound. That's Torrey Craig. He had five offensive rebounds last meeting. There's a block by Gaffer, but Aiden comes in. You're on that weak side as a defender. Three blocks tonight by the landlord. Right. He's trying to throw the lob up to Gaffer. Breaks the team's back. We talk about the Phoenix Suns trying to claw their way back into the conversation. DeAndre Aiden comes right back down and hits a three of his own. Rui Hachimura coming off the bench. Here's Lee. Step back three. Aiden with Hachimura now has nine blocks. That ties a career high as Paul comes up with the steal. All alone. No, Aiden, the offensive putback.